Hello everyone, this is my attempt to convert my uh, virtual texture demo to run with a VR headset. Uh, mostly just the, uh, you know, there's a lot of buzz at the moment about the Oculus Rift which I've uh, also placed an order for, but I don't have one yet and I'm just playing with my code just to get it as ready as, as I can. Um, I've I've taken a guess at a lot of properties like uh you know like the field of view of you know I've from just reading docs on the net I've I've tried to get as right as I can um uh the stereo separation uh, the warping all this sort of stuff I'm just guessing at um if anyone has a, a headset and can try this out and uh, give me any feedback that that'd be super great um, I'm uploading this to YouTube with the left on the left and the right on the right so that if you do have a headset you should be able to just play it back full screen on that device but if you're using YouTube's uh, 3D player I think it wants uh, left on the right right on the left so you might need to um, do the swap left and right um, I imagine uh, if you're just playing this back on a headset because it's just a video and you can't move your head I imagine it might make you uh, motion sick so that's why I'm trying to fly around as uh, slow as possible I don't want to make anyone sick um, so my motivation behind this is I think this renderer could be a good fit for VR because um, uh, everything sort of pre baked I get super high frame rates like I can easy do 120 frames a second which should be good for the latency um, the bad thing is though because uh, with the head tracking you can move your head around super fast it might have trouble um, pulling in what textures it needs like if you if you spin your head around really fast you know textures behind you may not be loaded um, yeah I think you could just throw a lot of memory at it on a PC and just try and have a massive texture cache and maybe even have like uh, uh, multiple readback buffers like one pointing behind you or, or, or just make the field of view really big on those so you can try and um, preload as much of that texture data as possible Anyway, I can't wait to get my hands on on one and uh, have a play for myself. Um, but yeah, if anyone is watching this on a on a headset and can give me any feedback, that'd that'd be super great. Thanks for watching. Bye.